It's W9OY demonstrating <coughs> diversity uh, properties of the Flex uh, 5000 receiver system. My um, system today consists of the Flex 5000, the second receiver, two vertical antennas separated by uh, three eighths of a wave on uh, 160 meters. Both antennas are resonant. Um, we'll start out with um, my line noise. As you can see, the noise is about minus 74 dBm, which is S9. Uh, presently, we're at uh, 400 hertz bandwidth. You can just barely make out a Canadian station in the background. First, we'll put on the noise blinkers. Station becomes uh, quite receivable. Go down in bandwidth. Now we're at 25 hertz. Turn on diversity reception. Diversity reception with the flex system includes a beam steering feature, which is this uh, area right here. This area defines a uh, plane uh, in which you can choose the relative phase and gain between the two antennas. As you can see, um, you're able to choose the best signal to noise ratio using this plane. This is a W4 station that uh, the VE station is talking to. As you can see, I'm able to choose a relative null. Using the phase gain plane. And also a relative peak. such that I have um, three possible antennas, three possible vertical antennas that I can choose from. Allows me to change direction. Notice the uh, this area here. You can watch the noise vary.
as I adjust the gain and phase between the two antennas. You can also see it in the S meter. very useful feature of the flex radio and to my knowledge this is the only radio on the market that does this. We'll go ahead and start turning off uh, the various uh, noise blanking characteristics of the radio. First the phase gain. Second we'll turn off the noise blankers in the diversity receiver. We're back to 400 Hertz no noise blanker. Turn off the diversity receiver back to 400 hertz and again no noise this is 99 OY I hope this uh, gives you some idea of how the Flex 5000 works in its noise blanking uh, capabilities